Hello, good morning. How you all doing this morning? This is Gucci's Kitchen. Welcome back to Gucci's Kitchen. Uh, this morning, I just want to show you all. Um, it's going to be a beautiful and hectic weekend. I just want to show you, uh, we have a party coming up this weekend. And um, I just want to take you along what, I'm, what I will be doing for signing this party. And guess what? I'm not going to tell you this party that is until when it's closed. Because I'm going to be showing you everything. So here I'm going to be using this chicken. I think I've never showed you guys before. You know, yeah, this chicken, I will be using this chicken. I don't know if you know this. It's really beautiful. Beautiful. So, what I'll be doing is just cut them into two and then start um, doing what um, I have to do for signing it to make sure. I get a healthy chicken, a beautiful taste out of it. So, but right away, I will be showing you this. I see these are two different ones. I use this for rice each time I want to make a particular kind of um, rice to just say this chicken. There's another type I usually use, but mostly I like it. Yeah, so if I have to make soup or stew or whatever for the soup and I want to add some chicken, I use this. I use this for you. So, um, this is a very good chicken. Yeah. I recommend this, I highly recommend this to you in case you don't know about it. Sometimes, it might be expensive, but yeah, I like to buy it down this because it's really, really good. I have to find a way around the power to about it. It's very okay for me. So I recommend this for you. So exactly what I want to do with this because I'm going to be using this for soup. Even though I have to use like this dry, you know, goat meat, cow food, oxtail, whatever. Uh, you know, I want to use or beef itself, yeah. But I usually use this as well, yeah, because this is really, really good. So, I want to uh, do this very type of chicken. I think I've done a video where I I did this uh, chicken, yeah, and I showed you all, uh, yeah. That this is the chicken. I usually, when I boil my hot water, I make sure it's properly boiled. All I do is chop it into the chunk of my size and then I just throw my lemon and lime into the hot water and then I, what I do is I you know pop boil it, pre-boil it, whichever way you want to call it, blanch chip like you know they call it here, blanch chip pre-boil. I pop boil it to make sure every liquid, everything they used to preserve it. Look at this. Look at this. So you don't just want to wash, wash this chicken and then just grill it or broil it, whatever thing you call it. No, you don't want to do that. You want to boil out all of this blood, whatever it is exactly. Boil it out, take off all the fat from this whole chicken and then make, make it, you know, good for your family and healthy. This is the reason why I'm, I'm showing you this. Yeah, you don't want to just wash this some certain way, they wash chicken. I've seen, when I go to some people, I like, see the way they wash their chicken. They just, some don't even wash it. They bring it out from the bag, the way it came, and they just put it, I mean, I was like, wow, you, know, you don't do that. So, you want to eat healthy, you want to do things right to make sure you help yourself, help your family, and whoever is coming to, to eat with you, you know, so that is the basic, the, you know, the, the reason why I have to show you this, I'm just explain it a little bit more. Boiling water, lemon, lime, I'm going to off this because the, I mean, the, um, 
is too much so I just off off this and then you see uh, the salt already you can see there's lime you can see there's lemon yeah yeah you can see I rinse it up It up properly, even if you wanna, even if you have to throw it inside the hot water, that is not the reason why you should not rinse it up. Yeah, you have to rinse it up properly. Yeah, rinse it up very, very well, and then you just throw it in the water. You see, when you're opening, you see the water coming out. As you see. See what I'm talking about. You see, you see what is coming out of it. That's why you have to rinse it up, brethren. This is very, very important. What kind of water is that? What would you say that water is? You know, so you don't want to just eat like that, my my brothers and sisters. Please, let's try. Let's try and uh, do the right thing. So what we take, you know. To what we do to our children, you know. So this is the last one. I just did the same thing. See. the bath make sure you give the proper bath a clean bath yeah because this is going into your belly your whole system that you must take your time to pull your food bread you need good time it does not take you so much time either. yeah it doesn't take you so much time see how huge they are looking they are really huge. Chew it in. You have to use a huge pot. Each time I want to do party stuff, this is the pot I use. It's a very huge pot. Yeah, very huge pot. I mean, this takes this. The any time I make rice up to this, it takes. I mean, it, it, you can feed hundred people with the pot of rice from from this very pot. So I usually use this for my parties. Yeah, like when people make order and ask me to make them party rice, soup, whatever. I use this basically. Yeah, so I'll cover it and then I'll let it cook. It come, I'll bring it out and then we go from there. Yeah. These are all the, uh, you know, ingredients I'm going to be using. Yes. The really this seasoning or that seasoning, I will just use all of this. Rub it on the body. I already put some salt in the hot water. I don't want it to be too salty or too sweet. I want that natural, that natural chicken taste in my soup or in whatever I'm going to be using it for. Yes, so here I will just, you know, um, blend all of this together. I will blend all of this together. And then add this as well because 
the chicken is used for soup or stew or some sauce so you know soup is a very uh, kind of special delicacy you don't want to mess it up with seasoning of that or that seasoning no all i'm going to be using is and then i'll be using this butter just to cream the, the chicken yeah so that it looks beautiful when it's happy when it's coming out from the oven yes i hate to blend stay with me i chop everything into pieces yeah so that my blender can be able to handle it yeah, you want to chop your stuffs into pieces, two little chunks. So, they do a good job for you. Sometimes they hang on to the, the blade, and um, you know, you won't be able to blend your stuffs well. You want to do this one, do it this way, chop all your stuffs, you know, some chunks. Maybe more tiny chunks like this, depending on the kind of blender you want to use. Some people don't chop their stuff, depending on the kind of blender you use. So, I know the type I'm using, so I try to help it as well. So, it will last some more for me. Yeah. So, I'll go ahead now. I want to, I just want to carry you along there with this. Water. I don't want it to be too watery. I'll blend and then I'll continue to put the remaining ones. enough to be your mat to be whatever seeds you want to put for you one of sometimes you know stay away from all of this seasoning and that seasoning I need to take it to anyway I'm not a too much seasoning person I tell you depending on the kind of food I'm preparing I don't play with my food Because those are very special delicacies you cannot just get in the in the Walmart store or in the Burger King or in the McDonald's. You can't get it anywhere. Just like that. Just like this burger or whatever. No, you can't get it anywhere. This is not um this is a special delicacy. Special delicacy, so you want to go, you know, you want to go through the right and beautiful way. All of these are enough to be your Maggi seasoning. Everything here I use for Maggi seasoning, I use for curry, I use for, yeah, I'll show you a video where I'll be doing all that, but you know, just, just hang on with me on this channel. Consistency. Everything I've learned. See the consistency. See the consistency. Water and then melt it up a little bit. Just one minute. You see the whole uh, fat sitting on top of the pot. Can you see the fat?
So guys, this is it. This is the chicken. The whole chicken. Three of them. In this very huge box. See? See what is coming out, guys. See? Why would you want to eat things like this? You have to learn how to eat healthy. Yeah, for your own good, for your family's own health benefits. This is very, very, very important. See? See what is dripping out. So you want to dip it into the hot water like so. Dip it into the hot water. Trying to rinse it off. That's what you're trying to do. You are just trying to rinse it off. So you bring it out again. Be careful when you're doing this. Yeah. Okay. See? Now it's good. So you want to take this. Be careful. Don't hold hot stuff like, like me. Yeah. All right, so I'm going to start screaming it. Give it a bit with the butter. Yeah, that will help it to look beautiful and tender. Just the same way. This is the same way I go with my coffee. Thanksgiving turkey, turkey, I want to to cool. I go the same way both for my customers, not just for my family alone. The same way I prepare food for my family, that's the same way I prepare food for my customers. That's the same way I prepare food for my friends and loved ones. Yes, because I don't have any other way to make food, but to do it the right way. I want to do anything I'm doing the right way. Yeah. Even at the job, they say you go extra mile, yeah. That is because I was taught to do things right. And I held on to it because that is the right way to go about things. You find out when you are doing things right, you feel good and you feel confident. You feel very confident about whatever you are doing. By the grace of God, you know, I, I, I mean, these things I keep telling you guys, I learned from my, my mom. I learned from my mom and some from my grandmother. I didn't uh, have the opportunity to stay too long with my grandmother, but each time I was there for visiting, I learned so much. I learned so much as well. I learned so much. And I'm very happy about it. very very happy about it guys um i wanted to tell you guys something that happened to my family we just god just blessed us with a beautiful baby girl we just had a beautiful baby beautiful you need to see that girl she is beautiful God just did that for us. Isn't God an awesome God? Our God is an awesome God. He is an awesome God. For forever and ever, His name will be praised. Yeah, put it on hold as the royal. Just put it on low. All of this sauce. Ooh, put it in your in your food. Oh my goodness. It's looking too good already. So I'll just put it straight into the oven. I'll do it uh, two in one. Let me see how that is. Right? Hmm? Yeah, because. It's three of them, so I think I should just put two in one tree. Yeah, because I don't want to put one. Yeah, see? It's properly clean. Clean is this is good.
just stir the same thing to the three of them. In case you want to cook like tomorrow. So guys, I'll just throw this into the oven and sit it there for until it has baked to the way, you know, I, I want. So guys, I'll set the other one and that is it. Guys, you know, I just uh, decided to add one more. Yeah, so, but um, I went behind the camera and I took one more because I want to make sure it's enough for the party. So, I'll just dip it inside the hot water. I'll just dip it inside the hot water and do the same like I did to other students. So, thank you. Our grilled, broad, whole chicken is ready. Ready, 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 guys. Yep, this is ready. It's, it's really, really huge. And it's beautiful. This is the sound. Yeah, I told you guys I went ahead to bring one more out from the freezer. Yeah. Try to be careful here. I don't want to make a mess, guys. 
It's not easy to clean. We clean like every second as we are cooking, we are cleaning. Mm. See how beautiful. See how beautiful they are all doing. <laughs> Isn't that amazing? So you can imagine all that sauce going into the soup. Oh my goodness. Camera lady, could you please show them the sauce? The sauce that's the... Yeah, I mean the... I'll say that is the broth, right? That is the broth. By the time that goes into the soup, what do you think that soup would taste like? Very good. <laughs> Guys, isn't this beautiful? Yeah, this is just beautiful. The ladies look gorgeous. Curious. <laughs> the curious look gorgeous. They all look gorgeous. I tasted it and it looks it tastes so so amazing. Yeah, it tastes so amazing. All you need to do is just Go about it the way I did it. I mean, try new things, you know. I love to show people good things, you know, and uh, I think this has inspired you. If it has, please give it a like. Give it a like, give it a thumbs up. Have fun with your food. Have fun in this kitchen. I used to have fun in my kitchen, I'm, I'm, I'm telling you. I used to have fun in my kitchen. I love to do my food in certain beautiful ways. So, see, I just want to go ahead and make for a tata. Yeah. Breakfast. So, I just want to go ahead and make a lovely for tata. So, you can just do this as well. If Gucci's inspires you, please let me know in the comment section and like this video. Like this video. Thumbs up. Click on that bell icon. Bagam, bagam, bagam. <laughs> How about that? <laughs> when Gucci uploads new videos in this very kitchen, you're gonna get notified one time. I mean, like one time. Yeah. Go to beats, this, beats, this, beats, this. I've gone ahead to chop some of this um, tomato. This is a beautiful one. I love to use it. So I've gone ahead to chop some of this. I deceived them. I've deceived them. So I will just. Vegetables, cooking a little bit. I have butter in that pot. Yeah, I've got veggies. I've gone ahead to season with this. Salt, garlic, and then you know Italian uh, parsley. Like this video now. Blended stuff, scotch bonnets, and all the rest of them. I want a spicy from Tata. Not very spicy because the camera lady is already screaming. Ooh. 
Yeah, Kobe said, are you not making us breakfast? I said, okay, you know what? Let me just do this. Make you guys fratata. Everybody was jumping up. Yeah, fratata. Yeah, fratata. <laughs> some people in their spirit are jumping up. Why some are like, oh, this is gonna be a little bit spicy. Yeah. I know this was that jumps up. I know this was that. My baby would just say, oh, baby, it's okay. Whatever you get me is fine. So, water for tea is ready. And then the fratata is going on. Stay tuned and see what we are going to have for breakfast. Let me go do my chicken, guys. Using the fractata for this. So hold on, the fractata is ready. Ooh, la la, this is sumptuous. See, see, guys, this is good. So. That is the way my girls like it. Put in some fried tartars. Thank you so, so much for staying till this period. If it has been an inspiring video, give it a thumbs up. Share this to your friends and loved ones. See how gorgeous. See how good. This is really good, guys, isn't it? Oh, this is good. Thank you all for staying. God bless you. Bye bye.